Hey guys, what's up? It's time for another, it's five minute chess. All right, sometimes I start the game, I don't even know if it's three minute or five minute or what. But this time it's five minute, we're going to play a Maroxi Bind, it looks like. I enjoy playing this opening, to be honest. Um, this should be two. This is all theory, let's see how much I can remember the moves. Um, is it B3 or F3? Can't even remember. I think F3 for some reason. Alright, what do I do here? Rook C1? I feel like this is what I do. Oh, yeah, it was a castle. I forgot. <laughs> um, and now Rook C2, isn't this? Oh, wait! I wasn't supposed to castle, right? I got confused. God damn it. Ah, uh, I just totally, you know... I wasn't supposed to castle. I was supposed to be able to go knight d5 now. Well, I can still do it. It's just it's just not as good when you can't take with the king or something. I, I just totally got confused. That's what happens when you move too fast in the chess opening. I guess I have to take with the rook. Oh, that's why I hate blitz sometimes. Because you, you, you have to rush through the opening a little bit. And it's very easy to just kind of make the wrong decision. Alright, so now I feel like I'm a little bit worse here. I gotta get control of the C file somehow. It's not easy though. Hmm. Alright, what to do? Bishop D3? Bishop D1? Alright, I guess I'm just going to do this. Uh, I'm just going to hold on. <clears throat> Bring my king to e2. His pieces are a little better and he has the the file. So I, I consider myself a bit worse here. This is just so stupid. I know this opening well. I've played it a million times. And I just spaced out, unfortunately. Um, you're, you're not supposed to castle there. I think I should just not move my pawns, or should I go a3? See, if I go a3, he'll go rook b8, b4, and then he gets like more play on the queen side. So I'm going to intentionally not touch anything over there. I'm just kind of put my pieces uh, like closer to the king side, I guess. I mean, I, it's not the most pleasant position ever. Maybe. Oh wait, I can't. I can't move that guy. All right, I'm just gonna move the king over. I guess a3 looks like really annoying, but what can I do? And then I'm probably going to go rook b1. And <clears throat> and then I don't know, I mean, it's not going to be easy for him to, to break my, to break my fortress, basically. Maybe I should go g4 someday. I don't know. Oh, I need some water, man. So yeah, so now his big question is how to beat me. This is just so annoying. You know, like I, I to get such a stupid position is just really annoying. Uh, why did I do this? Well, I wanted to. I can't even quite describe it. I'm gonna play this move. And I'm just gonna like shuffle around for I barely have moves, but I'm gonna I'm gonna like shuffle around for a little bit. I think I should not take it or should I ignore it? I don't know, I'll take it. Oh, that was probably really, really, really bad. I mean I might be just in big trouble now. That was horrible. Alright, let's think. King to e2, bishop takes, king takes, rook c2. I mean, I'm just lost. Just hopeless position. Alright, I'm just going to do this. Oh my god, it's so frustrating chess sometimes. I mean, obviously I didn't have to lose so badly, but it was really annoying. Just, I get so annoyed when I forget the moves and blitz. Especially in five minutes. I, I just need to think a little more because the time is a little less important. Um... I mean, I guess I'm gonna. I don't 
don't know actually. There's not really. Okay, I guess I can take this. The rook c1 and the rook d4. I don't think this is the best way of playing it, honestly. But it should still be winning. Just, you know, why why, why even do it? You know, there's no need. Just take my bishop and then go rook c2. Because now, like, I have some weird counterplay. Bishop's the opposite and everything. He's totally winning still. But again, I, I he, he's totally messed it up also. Um, let's see. <clears throat> G4, I probably go G4. Probably if King with Bishop E4, King E3, right? Oh no, then he goes Rook B2. Let me think then. Interesting. If Rook E1, Rook B1. Oh, King E3, Rook B1, Bishop B2. How horrible is it? Is the question. It's probably pretty horrible, but I'll do it. Just not sure what else to do, honestly, at this point. He'll take the bishop, I assume. And he's. I didn't see that for some reason, but he's. His bishop's opposite, but it should be winning. Uh, I should go h4, h5, h6, ASAP, but it should, should still be losing. That's interesting. Um, all right, I'll take it. <laughs> I mean, it's it's just a lost position. The two central pawns are enough to win, but you know, I can always. I don't know what I can do. Bishop's opposite is just like a little bit annoying, but in this particular case, should be no big problem to win for him. Bishop e6, I assume. Either that or king f7. I don't know if that was the best. Maybe it. Maybe I should have kept my pawn in h2. Just because it would be harder to attack. Oh boy. See, in the, the reason why um, this is impossible to defend is usually I can I think about sacrificing the bishop for two. Like, like, for example, in a position I could go here usually, but I can't sack my bishop for the pawns because, like, if there was no other pawns in the board, this would be a draw. That's that's basically what I mean. Uh, would it, or can he get his king to c2? He could probably get his king to c2. So I don't, I don't think it actually would be a draw. But anyway, game's over. I lost. Pisses me off. Uh, the pro... I just screwed up the opening. Just like... Uh, one thing, I'm really bad when I screw up the opening. You're not supposed to castle. Just, I think there was a game of... I don't know, Polgars or something. When, it was, this is a little different, but now if queen a5, knight, knight to d5 is basically the idea. And it's, it's kind of comfortable for white. Like, like if he takes, I take. And white has a nice position. I think it's slightly better. Castle is just a big mistake. Like, it's the whole point of the opening, don't castle. And somehow he did some slightly mo weird move order, and I just castled on instinct, like, without thinking. It's just, just so stupid. Oh, uh, it's so annoying because it's a blitz game. It doesn't really matter, like, did I mess the opening up? Because I would definitely not mess up in any halfway serious game. But it still frustrates me. It still pisses me off. And, you know, I, I don't know, maybe maybe I could have played better, of course, but I get pissed. <laughs> Whatever, I quit. See you all later. Bye-bye.